All right, folks, we are back with the second half of our Paragon line. Uh, Paragon line, that's how you say it. Our Paragon line run here. Uh, so this is, you know, we're, we're entering the second hour of fighting game sets here. So I'm literally, this is this is an interesting thing about this tournament, right? There is definitely a uh, endurance aspect to it that we don't necessarily always get to experience in tournaments since we usually are out within, you know, two to three uh, games there. I mean, 3-2 is the best we've done so far, but yeah, we've already played, this will be double that right now, so... It's definitely uh, something that I've noticed where I'm, I'm not playing. I mean, to be, at first, I wasn't playing very well, I think, because it was just a matter of... Uh, oh, damn. At first, I think it was just a matter of me being like, there's not quite as much pressure in Paragon if you lose, right? Because you just like, uh, you know... Oh, Blanca Ball. So true. Uh, you just... You don't go like down to loser's bracket, and then if you lose that one, it's all over or anything like that. So I think I was, I was being a little bit careless earlier. Okay. Oh, I thought that was minus at the end there. I suppose not. I thought if I blocked all that, I could I could hit a button. Clearly, I was just being naive. Oh, it's gonna hit us too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, cute. Okay, so they didn't get the full cinematic, which I will be grateful for. I will count my blessings there, but they do space us out. They back dash the six six L there and blow us up. Understandable. Um, but yeah, so at first we just weren't. We were playing kind of careless, and now I think it's starting to set in that like I'm just like having a little bit of trouble uh, focusing this much for this long. Owie. But that's also good. This is this is a good muscle to, to to flex a little bit, right? To train up. Oh, they guess command grab. Well done. Spot dodge. Any Blanca Ballers? No, no Blanca Ballers. Highly unfortunate. Oh, damn, I thought maybe there would be uh, enough time for me to, to do something there, but... What? That didn't convert? Unfortunate. Highly unfortunate, I dare say. Uh, we don't have the headbutt to do the uh, the, the save jump there, so uh, I, I'll have to set it back down. That's a good example of that, like, me me going into the save jump route, even though I could... Oh, they're jumping. That's not good. Yeah, we're gonna get Blancas too. Uh, this one extra brave, brave point might help us, but no, I think we're dead. Yeah, Zeta. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is uh, South Zeta rolls, unfortunately, but it's fine. Um, but yeah, like something like that, like going to the safe jump route, even though I knew I didn't have headbutt, is like a good example of just some some of these mistakes that are happening now as we're getting deeper into these sets. But it's okay, right? Again, as long as I'm gonna do my best to still play as cle the, the cleanest Grand Blue that I can, right? And otherwise, you know, win losses, whatever. That that's all. It's all secondary. Again, actually, I, I would dare say tertiary. Okay, I guess I could have maybe uh, two H her there. Wow. I guess they, yeah, they really expected me to lunge out with something there because it looked like uh, I, would, I would get a turn after quite a long time of not getting a turn. So well well read by them, to be sure. This is a strong player, no doubt about it. Owie. Okay. Pogo. Oh, and I tried to, I couldn't, I didn't get a second one. I wanted to brave counter the, the, the first Pogo, but I was like, no, I'll wait for them to commit to something, and they just didn't. And there's a nice little perfect there. We're, we're, we're definitely getting uh, blown out a little bit here. It's, it's fine, it happens. Um, what do we do around start, man? I'm, I'm scared. I like... That, that's not bad, at the very least there. We did a little bit of, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. We, did, we actually played neutral for a little bit there instead of just dashing and hoping for the best, right? Which is something that I definitely tend to do. I have a bad habit of doing on occasion. Okay, she retreats. I guess let's get some screen space here, hopefully. That's, oh, apparently not plus enough. Not spaced out well enough, rather. Get away from me, you monster. Oh, no conversion there. Highly unfortunate. Okay, okay, but there you go. That's actually, so that's a little better, right? We actually played a little bit of neutral there, and we ended up with uh, the ability to uh, to actually run some offense. Now, how many, how many, how much more offense we'll get to run? That's a good question. Uh, but we will at least, man, I really need to be uh, anti-airing them a bit more, I think. Oh, I, ch I thought maybe if I, uh, you know what, if I had done ultimate command, oh, we dead, by the way. It is, it is Zeta. Hard to say. No, no, okay. okay. I thought maybe if I, maybe if I did ultimate command grab there, that would have worked. Oh yeah, I got to spot dodge right away there. Fair enough. I think I had the right idea. I thought they were gonna meet me in the air, and I did, I did ex command grab. But ex command grab is only uh, throw invincible, right? It's not strike invincible. Uh, so I think if we had done ultimate command grab there, that actually does have some full invincibility on it. We might be able to grab them out of the air, and it would have been a nice little highlight. But unfortunately, we didn't, uh, we didn't manage to think on our feet quite so quickly. Uh, oh yeah, they, this is our room, right? I was like, I was gonna leave the the room, but no. Uh, okay, okay. GG's, indeed. Uh, let's... I assume they've reported the game. Yeah, indeed. Good good 2-0 to them there. Uh, yeah, the second one is a, is a them win, also. All right, yeah. Again, uh, we're, we're, you know, taking our, our fair share of L's here, but it's fine. Uh, I think more so than the, the losses, what I'm still worrying about a little bit is, like, it just feels like I'm making a lot of silly mistakes. But I'm going to chalk that up to... I mean, I'm not making excuses necessarily, right? It's just like, you, sometimes it's important to figure out like, I'm not playing well, why do I think that is, right? And, and to an extent, you know, you, you can dig down. I'm autopiloting a little bit. Okay, why am I autopiloting a little bit, right? And I think it's it's uh, par partially being tired, uh, partially maybe I didn't get quite as much sleep as I should have, right? And by the way, none of these are like excuses that suddenly make it okay that I'm doing any of this. I just want to point that out. 
It is more the idea of let's diagnose why this current state of play is happening so that we can attempt to get it to not happen again, right? I definitely didn't get the most sleep last night, which is unfortunate, and which probably wouldn't have been as big of a problem if, again, this wasn't such a long tournament, right? We have to you have to keep your focus up for a very long time. Uh, that's where things like this could start to get to. Um, I haven't eaten anything yet today either, but that's I mean that's just uh, you know it's, it's how it goes. Uh, Ramadan hours, but it's fine. It's fine. I don't think any of this is necessarily that big. Like I, we can still play well in spite of all of this, right? But it's you know you, you analyze the whole thing holistically because playing your best is not well. We've said this a couple of times, right? Playing your best is not necessarily out of your hands. It's not this magical thing that just happens every now and then. Uh, staying hydrated, for example, that's always that's a good start. I haven't drank a lot of water today either. Right, very important. Uh, eating well, sleeping well, things like that, warming up beforehand. These are all things I definitely could have done a little bit better today. But regardless, we will still do our best to uh, clean it up in spite of all of this. Because we can still definitely be, like, it's not like we're doomed to play the way that we currently are based on our current state. We could still definitely be playing better. I just do have to focus on, wait, is this nothing? Oh my god, it is. Awesome. This is another Ladiva. On my way. I'm pretty sure this is another Ladiva and quite the strong one at that. So this will be fun. We get the chance to uh, to fight a. I haven't fought a Ladiva in tournament yet, and again, this is I get a little. It feels a little different, right? Just because uh, was it nothing? Yes, nothing. It feels a little different just because again, there's not. This isn't necessarily a, a traditional double elimination bracket, but it's still good to to get the chance to play against one of these uh, tournament players. His name is Average Grappler. Uh, somehow I doubt this, um, but yeah, this is this should be a good time here. He's a, he's just a little guy. Ladiva, Ladiva. All right. If anything can wake me up, it's Ladiva Mirror, right? It's always a lot of fun, and also it's always a very mentally taxing for me. I tend to have a very hard time with a mirror, but this is good. It can it can test my uh, my ability to wake the hell up. So let's let's go from there. Uh, oh, okay, yes, all good. Just double checking something. Wonderful, they've read it up, and we are live. Oh, they're crying. Why is there why is their card tag just the little the little uh, sad face there? All right, nothing. Let's see what you got. Our our skins are at least very distinguishable. There's no way you can confuse us. They got the sunglasses and stuff. I got the the, the Vern mask and the bright red. Oh, round start. Okay, okay. Round start 5H. I guess, yeah. Beats uh, beats 6XL, which is what I was going for there, right? We guessed the command grab there, luckily. Let's get some corner carry on them here. Oh, damn. I tried to uh, jump at the very last second there to, to meet them in the air, and uh, I just got hit instead. Unfortunate, to say the least. Raging Strike. Are they going to super us? Yes. Okay, okay. They want the, the damage and the brave points. I understand. I understand. Uh, I am going to super them, I think. Oh, no. They, they backed up. Oh, man. Wah, 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 wah. Okay. Interesting, to be sure. Get away from me, you fiends, even. Oh, yeah. Fair, 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 fair. We're dead. Oh, we're not dead. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Chansu. Okay, this, this Chansu is rapidly diminishing, though. Get grabbed. Ner oh, they guessed it. They guessed it. They know. Oh, okay. They know. They know. They guessed the grab. That was actually pretty uh, dangerous there on their part. Right? If, they, if they got hit with the strike there, it would have been very uh, very problematic for them. But they, they managed it. Nice. We hit the first air command grab. That means we're the better Ladiva, right? That's uh, that's Those are the rules. Oh, okay, okay. I tried to. I, I thought they were going to run up command grab there, so I tried to, to mash, and I guessed incorrectly. Uh, unfortunate. Oh, my God. The reset. Hit. Get hit, nerd. Oh, fair. So true. Okay. We escape, uh, grab hell there, at least temporarily. Interesting. All right. Not a bad conversion for us from a bit of a weird scenario there. You're not going to catch me complaining. Get away. Uh, we can kill here. Oh, but no, I didn't. Yeah, yeah, very unfortunate. We could kill there, but I tried to do a Raging Strike conversion. I didn't have any brave points. So, unfortunately, no Raging Strike conversion for me. Okay, we're alive because we're Ladiva. Okay, I wasn't actually super confident in that fact, but... Bonk. Ah! <laughs> I mean, I tried it. I really did try it. I really did try it against another Ladiva, right? You can you can do that cheese on some people, right? But I mean, one, a master rank player, and two, a master rank Ladiva. I really did try it, and it was let's just say it wasn't uh, the best idea. I, I definitely deserved my loss there. That's a, that's a good example of a bit of a careless option there, I think. Especially since they squ very clearly were just sitting there waiting for me, right? It's not like they were uh, gonna hit a button or something. Oh damn, damn! Guess command grab the second time and guessing correctly. Again, yeah, I mean, once once you get, uh, you, you want to avoid being put in the corner in the Ladiva Mirror, because once you are, it's uh, difficult, right? I mean, your, your own DP doesn't even work against yourself because your headbutt loses to throws, right? So it's, uh, it's a big problem. Okay, interesting. Get away from me, you fiend, you monster. 
That's not good. Well, we're dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair enough, fair enough. Ow, my face. I need that. Let's, let's try and at least uh, take a round here, you know? We get, let's, let's do our best to, to clean up our, our play a little here. Bonk. One of those. One of those. Okay, okay. Much better start to the round. Maybe 2U was all I needed. The power of 2U. All right, a little hard knockdown there for you. Okay, we'll get grabbed. Not what you love to see, for sure. Oh, and they whiffed the 6XL into grab. Not like this. Are they going to do it again? No. Okay, but luckily the 6XL did connect there. Oh, no. Oh, they brave countered that. Wonderful. That's, uh, that was not really something that they needed to brave counter, necessarily. And we do catch their headbutt there. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. This round is looking a little bit more promising. Uh, I'm going to do this just because I want to them to be at zero brave points. And I want to maximize the damage here. Damage actually does matter a little bit here. Because I want to make sure that they were in a 50-50 between strike and throw. Oh, but they, they guess strike and they guess right. Okay, but now they're in trouble. Yeah, yeah. No DP, no brave points, nothing. No bitches. They were in chip range there. They had to do something, right? And luckily, they were not able to. Uh, back dash. So true, Bessie. Oh, God. We just got raw, we got, we got raw clothesline? It's like that? That's minus. I should really just hit them after that. Or no, no, it's not because I'm Ladiva. So it's actually fine. Okay, brave counter. So true, best hit. Get Rex, nerd. Yeah, yeah, wonderful. Oh, we didn't get the... I thought we were going to get close M there. We got far M. Not like this. I messed up my conversion. Okay, okay. Are they going to Raging Strike here? No. Get away. Oh, what do you guys think? I'm scared. Oh, man. I tried to jump you there. Maybe I should have command grabbed or some, or, uh, or some other such idea. We sure are standing still here. We can't really afford to be doing this. Oh my god, we just got hit by that. Okay, okay, fair enough. Fair play, fair play. Yeah, I'm actually not very good against ultimate clothesline, believe it or not, because it's not a move that I run into very often. Uh, wait. Was that one? I don't, even, I don't even know. I can't remember if that was the first game or the second game, or if they just want to play more games because it's fun. I, I can't remember. But let, you know what? Let, why not? Let's get... Oh, no, no, okay, okay. It is over. It is over. They're reporting the match. GG. Okay, okay. I was like... We could've just... Oh, okay. Yeah, sure, sure, okay. We are playing it out. I'm, I'm totally okay with this. Why not? It's a good time, right? Oh, nice, nice, okay. Yeah, the, uh... You know, us, us Ladivas, when we find each other, it's nice to... We can, we can spend a little bit more time together, it's fine. Bonk. I think it was an accidental rematch, but we'll, we'll make it work. Nice. Little double jump action there to bait to the reversal super. Or any headbutts or anything like that. Any sort of reversal, really. I'm gonna run up to you and grab and be out of range because I'm bad. Oh no, how could this happen to me? Owie, my face. I need that, please. Okay. Oh uh, man, I do want to super skybound dart them. But, okay, but I was like, I'm pretty sure they're gonna jump. Maybe I should have, I definitely should have done uh, the clothesline there though. Again? Again? Oh, they did it first. I think I'm out of range. Yep. Oh, but I have no punish. I'm horrible. Oh, God. Oh, God. Wait, we're alive. Okay, okay. I just had to will that into existence. Four seconds. Nice, nice, nice. I don't think that backdash actually would have put them out of range of Super Skybound Dart. I think we could have Super Skybound Darted there and still worked. But I guess it would be, you know, they would have been airborne or at least grab invincible during the back. Oh, nice conversion. They would have been uh, grab invincible during the backdash, right? So it wouldn't, uh, it wouldn't work out regardless. So I, I understand their, their idea there. Oh, my God. I tried to spot dodge that and I just didn't in time. Bonk. Okay, we catch them on the way down there. Get punched in the face. Headbutt. Understandable, I suppose. Avoid the grab. Nice. Oh, wow, it's a counter hit, so that actually, convert, that actually just uh, combos clean, huh? Good to know. All right, and then we'll do this just for the bravery, mostly. Uh, do we think they're going to jump or guess strike? I guess that they would guess strike, and I guess right, but then I didn't convert any further. Oh, man, are we dead? I don't think so. Yeah, no. Oh, nice. We should have command grabbed. No! Okay, okay. Well played, well played, well played. Good games, good games. Yeah, the better the better Ladiva. No doubt about it. Uh, oh, let me confirm these results real quick. That was fun, that was fun. Good to get a chance to uh, to play against a, uh, a strong Ladiva. And we will yeah, head out here. Let's see, who's our next match going to be? So our, 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 we officially are, you know, quite the losing record on our hands. So any any idea of top eight is firmly out of our minds at this point. So. But it's fine, it's fine. Again, that was not necessarily the goal here. The goal was to to play, get some experience under our belts, right? Uh, and, and go from there.
Um, now, unfortunately, I don't think I've been, because I've kind of been uh, not playing as well as I might, or not necessarily, I'm not playing as actively as I might. I don't think I'm learning as much from these as I might want to, but it's okay. We will still uh, keep going here and, and do our best. Uh, hello, X9 Breaker. The, the Ladiva match there? I don't know. What do you guys think? My my my, anal my analysis... There you go. There's a good sign of my brain around, right? My analytics engine is very quickly falling apart here. Uh, but if I, had to, if I had to force myself to think about it a little bit more... Do I have the shrimp? I want the shrimp. There you go. Um, my analytics engine is very quickly falling apart as I run out of the brain glycogen here. But uh, to my understanding, I think the main thing that we... I don't think we did anything like super horribly bad there. I think we just honestly, uh, maybe, you know what? Maybe we should have command grabbed a little bit more on our offense because I think they blocked a lot and then just brave countered us. That's going to be, I, I, I know it's like, we say that a lot, but it also tends to be, it's one of my more recurring problems, right? Oh, interesting. We, uh, her parry was not active anymore, I suppose. We'll take those. Uh, but yeah, I think, I think we, we should have command grabbed a little bit more, right? Because what happened a lot of the times there is we would brave counter and then we would get our turn and they would immediately brave counter us back and then we it, it would be their turn, right? And eventually, if that keeps happening... Oh, we actually could have uh, beat that if I command grabbed a little bit faster. Oh, I need to... Right, 2H. Uh, hit, punishable on hit. Right, so we need to be a little bit more uh, careful about canceling into stuff afterwards. There. Bonk. Oh, God. Whiffs on crutches. Get away from me while you're here. Okay. Get double away from me. Oh, man. Not good. Double plus ungood, in fact, I dare say. Now you can get away, though. Oh, out of range. Oh, no punish. Oh, but punish. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Well played, well played. I mean, poorly played by me, for sure. There's a couple of opportunities that we let slip away there, but it's fun. At this point, this is kind of, uh, you know, it's one of those things where I'm just... We're, we're, every now and then, we have one of these sessions where our mind isn't really working. Uh, it just so happens that it's happening in tournament right now, which is unfortunate. But again, like, the, the results of this tournament are a foregone conclusion at this point. Like, even if we won every single match that we played from now on, we're probably not getting into top 8. So we're just, we're just here to, uh, to try and learn as much as we can. But uh, at the same time, every now and then, not every day is super conducive to learning, right? Right, for whatever reason right now, I'm just uh, not really playing super well, and that's okay. We will still try and get as much out of it as possible. We, we talked about it earlier, but in times like this, where your autopilot is kind of just... You, you're having a hard time taking the reins away from your autopilot, uh, you can just... This is a good time to train the autopilot. If autopilot's going to be making all the decisions, let's at least try and steer him in the direction of uh, making good decisions to an extent. Because having a strong autopilot is important. We've talked about it before. Uh, but yes, get kicked in the face, nerd. That was a much better round there, right? Again, we command grab more, and suddenly, the round looks better. Isn't that wild? It really is, like, a, a very consistent pattern for me, I've found. Get grabbed. They DP don't wake up. That's okay. Beats, beats both options, I suppose. Get grabbed again. Again, the more we command grab, the, the better it goes, because it makes it a lot scarier for our opponents, too, right? It's not just that it, it, it helps us with our mojo, because, like, of course, hitting the command grab activates neurons, and we like that. But again, it also just it makes it much more uncertain for the opponent as to what they should do on wake up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a pretty good example there of just like, what are they supposed to do there? It's 50-50, right? So, all right. Uh, we will rematch here and try and take the second game. I really think I just need to, this is a good opportunity for me to, if, since I'm, I'm kind of in autopilot mode right now, this is a good opportunity for me to make my autopilot just default to command grabbing as much as possible. I don't think, I don't think we can ever really go too astray with that if that's our autopilot option. My problem is our autopilot option right now is strike, right? And that's what's causing us a lot of, uh, a lot of trouble here. Owie, my face. Okay, part of that whiffed. It's fine, I suppose. Get kicked, nerd. Get DP'd, nerd, but except I'm the nerd this time. Get kicked again. Are you gonna do it again? No. I thought maybe they would. Alright. Oh, nice. Okay, that's a wall bounce, which lets us get some Oki here. Gotta get grabbed. Nerd. Get down there. What do you guys think? Oh, they actually... Okay, okay. I, I would have uh, gotten punished there anyway, but I, I, I tried SPD and I got clothesline. But they, they guessed correctly, regardless. So, kudos to them. I got baited. I got baited by the ultimate spin. Well done, well done. I tried to brave counter something right away there. That was good there, because that covered a lot of options, right? It covers uh, me mashing a button. It covers uh, me trying to reverse for Skybound Dart. So it's a very, it's a good option that we need to respect a bit more, or a lot more, even. Okay, fair enough. So true, Bestie. Ow, I got air to air there, successfully by them. Oh, man. Okay, okay. That's unfortunate uh, timing there. But at least we, again, if we're attempting, oh, man. If we're attempting command grabs at this point, knowing knowing the state that I'm in, I'm not going to do uh, too upset. Uh, even if even if we did mess up, we got baited again. Nice. Okay, okay. That's uh, one to one is my understanding. Uh, but they take a game back there. Well done. Yeah. Even if we're going to be uh, messing up the timings, at least, again, we're just trying to train the autopilots to do command grab as much as possible here. Bonk. Okay. The double there catches us out. 
Bonk, bonk. Ooh, okay, they, did, they uh, jumped there, possibly, expecting a command grab. Or maybe they wanted to parry and they did it uh, a little incorrectly, I'm, un I'm unsure. Nice, but yeah, so now we've been command grabbing them a lot, so they've been very conditioned to, like, avoid command grab, and now we get our high reward options, right? So this is kind of, and then, and then, we command grab them anyway. Oh, wow, they guess command grab again? That is actually some nerves to steal. But you gotta, uh, interesting, their, their blue move beats mine, unfortunately. But you gotta, you gotta put some respect on the name there, I think. Get away from me. Nice. Harry's not gonna work there, right? Oh, baby. What do you guys think? I'm just a little a little worried about some potential flip shenanigans. And, okay, okay. Uh, I think we're... Mm, what do you guys think? We might be dead. Okay, okay. No, luckily not. And that was, unfortunately, rather uh, predictable, in my opinion. That's fine. Again, I mean, I've been doing lots of predictable stuff. I don't mean to say that in, like, a derogatory way at all. I just mean, in that's, like, the, as, as, it's like chess, you know? As you lose pieces, you get fewer and fewer options. And they had very few options left besides DP there. So I was, I was ready to capitalize on that. Oh, covering minus frames with parry. Understandable. Have a nice day. We'll take this throw, I suppose. Okay, interesting. Again, I should have gone for throw there. I need to, I need to learn to throw more in those class situations where we're right in each other's faces. Because it is the fastest option a lot of the time. Well, actually, it is straight up the fastest option in the game. It only loses to, like, DPs and supers and things like that, right? Even spot dodge and all that are not throw invincible. Excellent. Nice. Get grabbed, nerds. Do you think they think we're going to do it again? Oh, they just decided. Well, no, I guess they didn't. Because uh, that wouldn't have worked if we had actually thrown them, right? Nice. All right. Cool. We take our, our victory there. You know, at least at least we are, we're still beating these uh, these S pluses at the very least, even if it is more hard fought than I might like it to be. But you know, we're, again, this is uh, let's let's send them the little, little shrimp there. It's as simple as that. Again, at this point, for post match analysis, we just need to talk about how much how much we command grabbed, right? And I think we did a good job there. We we got the command grab mix like firmly stuck in their head, you know. Uh, so that's 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 good as far as I'm concerned. Because again, we're just you know we're not functioning at 100 percent capacity right now, and that's okay. So let's at least recognize that and still try to get some value out of the session. And right now the value is training our autopilot to command grab. Water. What a great time. What a time to be alive. Uh, it would be nice if we could potentially go even, uh, which I think right now we are, where are we? Our standings are going to be somewhere. I think we're five and seven. Is that right? I think that's right. So if we could go seven and seven or eight and eight or something, I, I would, I'll be happy with that. That could be a nice little goal here to try and end off our last couple of sets with some wins to go seven. Yeah, we're five and seven. The room was named Fight, which is very funny. Hello, Yugo. Nice to meet you. Uh, let's hit you with a quick bow. Oh, they play Siegfried. Interesting. Um, wonderful. This is actually the first time I played on this arcade cabinet. Maybe it's good luck going all the way to the left here. Is this a S plus plus Siegfried? Yes, indeed. Chocolate milk. Interesting. So they they're it's an Armaya tag, right? But it's a Siegfried player. So I don't know if maybe their Narmaya is master and they're just taking their Siegfried to tournaments, or maybe they just like Narmaya, right? And that's why she's on their card. That's that's you know very valid and very possible. They just have their waifu on their card, but they you know they fight as Siegfried, but they fight for their waifu. This is this is a, a noble pursuit, regardless. Ow ow. Okay, bad start. Uh, we're we're here in the corner. Oh, this is a yeah yeah. Oh right, because yeah, if you spot dodge that, you are just punishable, right? That's like a setup there. So I don't know. I think maybe it's even better to just take the unblockable. I forget. Somebody explained to me to an extent how that Siegfried shenaniganry over there works, but it's like, um, oh man, like you, the unblockable will hit you there unless you spot dodge. But if you spot dodge, you get you you are still punishable. I think. So I, I'm actually not sure. I get if you have a DP, I suppose that's oh that's the best option there. What do you guys think? You say resist this? Okay. Oh, unfortunate. We could have actually canceled that into headbutt and gotten some some good stuff going potential. Oh, the dash M. Okay, okay. The low. Fair enough. No need to be blocking high there. I guess Siegfried doesn't have any fast overheads or anything like that. So stand blocking that was definitely a mistake. I, I, I can say with some confidence. Yeah, right there. Right, because he he can hit us with a low from very far away there, but he can't really do anything like that with an overhead. Okay, that's not the the worst conversion I've ever seen in the sense of uh, for us anyway. It didn't do that much damage off of a two H. He is just running at us menacingly. He's, he's, he's a madman? He's lost his mind? Okay, we block those. Nothing. Oh, no jump over for us. We have to super jump if we want to beat that. Which I, I, I wasn't jumping to beat the projectile necessarily. So true best here. Oh, okay. This is bad. I would describe this as uh, ungood. 
Oh, I tried to catch his back dash there, but no. I needed a big hit there to just get us back in the game, and unfortunately we didn't quite find it. That was a really good reaction on the DP there. He could have spot dodged, but like still, the fact that he, he reacted to that and, and blew us up, well done. Uh, bonk. Oh, okay. Yeah, we've been jumping a lot, and he's been 2 h us a lot for it. So we need to be a little bit more uh, careful, I think. And jumping against Siegfried Record there is just a horrible idea all around. Loses to like a lot of options. Or loses very badly to a lot of options, at least. Nice. We'll take that that counter hit there. Okay. We could have swap dodged that, but it's okay. What the hell? Maybe he thought... I mean, that EX uh, overhead swing is plus, isn't it? So there's no reason for me to be swinging there. Maybe he thought I was going to be really belligerent and he wanted to DP me, but he could just counter hit me with something otherwise. Oh, okay. I thought we were actually a little too early on the spot dodge there, but luckily, it was not the case. What was that for? What's the uh, potential idea behind the spot dodge there? Okay, so true. Is it if we, like, what what can we do from that distance to threaten him that he needs to, to be spot dodging? We just not blocking it? I suppose not. Okay, okay, okay. That was just some... Some very, uh, I mean, there's definitely a couple of times where we're just barely out of range there, but also I think we just, uh, we're a little too, I, I, I could feel the dial-up internet in my brain there a little bit, unfortunately. Oh, and there, yeah, there it goes again. Okay, yeah, there you go. Roll is a pretty good option against a lot of Siegfried's Rekka options, right? In the sense that it does, it, it beats a lot of them, except for, uh, I guess it'll lose to the throw, it'll lose to him doing nothing, and it'll lose to him, uh, what's the word? Doing the sort of upward swing there, because it recovers fast enough to punish rolls. At least it uh, recovers fast enough to punish Diva's roll. Maybe not the case for other ones, but definitely it's not, definitely something that, that is relevant for us. Okay, brave counter, understandable. We could have actually uh, supered through that, I think. That's something that I'm considering doing. I want to, I want him to get some space and then projectile, and we can blow him up for it. Maybe, maybe he doesn't know. Oh, that is the wrong one. That is very much the wrong one. We got that we actually won right there uh, this round at least, but I I messed up. Ah, I jumped. I was meant to be a SPD for sure. Nice. Nice. Double 5H. I mean, definitely should have canceled the first one at the clothesline, but we'll take those. We will take those. All right. Super jump. So true. I should... What did I say earlier? I, should, I need to jump less against the Siegfried? Uh, well, there there was my attempt at that, if you were if you were curious. Okay, get away from me. Okay, brave counter. I guess I'll get away from you now. Spot dodge. I guess... Oh, that, that was for the brave counter, I suppose. That one, though, I just reacted to and punished. Or not punished, but at least we, we were fast enough that we got the counter hit there. It's always good. Oh. Get away from me. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, yeah. Doing nothing there will punish rolls for sure. He doesn't get a combo off this mid-screen, though, does he? Yeah. Oh, we could have supered him there, actually. Whoa, again? Oh my god. You went for our toes twice in a row, the madman? Okay, okay, well done, well done. Uh, well played, well played. Our, our toes have been uh, demolished, absolutely destroyed. Let's hit him with the GG's in the start. Uh, GG chat there. GG. And we'll report the games. We'll play probably, I mean, we, we only have about 15 minutes left of it here. So we'll uh, we'll play E1, both of them, yes, yes. Um, yeah, we, we have about 15 minutes left here, so we can probably play maybe two to three more sets here. And then I'll, I'm, I'll go, uh, you know, take a nap or something, because clearly my I'm, I'm a little bit uh, tired. But I hope you guys are having fun here. I know it's, it's, it's a little bit uh, of... I hope, I hope this isn't, you know, a slog or anything. There's a lot of matches going on. Uh, but, you know, it's, it's, it's a different experience, right? Paragon, it's a completely different uh, experience from the other tournaments that I've been in so far. And it's valuable to have, right? Even though I, I do think... Uh, like I mentioned in maybe the last video? I forget what I said last video and what I said in this video, but it is, I think, a little much for my schedule every Friday in the sense that uh, Friday is a schedule. That usually I have a lot of things booked, and I moved something this week to, to be in Paragon, but uh, I think consistently I don't think I'm going to be able to quite manage it. Uh, as well as the fact that it is, it's, it's hard, man. It is quite hard. Uh, kudos to anyone who has the endurance to play, like, you know, 20 matches and, and still be very, like, locked in for their uh, final match like they were for their first one. But yes, you guys can uh, can analyze in my stead and try and figure out what I'm doing wrong and maybe talk to me about it in the comments. Because right now, I am just a... Uh, I have undergone a Ladiva Bottomy. Interesting. Okay, we got loads there, but luckily no conversion from them. Oh, wow. Both of those 5-8s is lost, huh? Highly unfortunate. Oh, and TG's gonna hit me, because of course he is. The evil demon cat who always uh, gets me. Right when I expected the least. I can't brave counter out of GG as soon as I might want sometimes either. I don't know why that why that is necessarily. Hello, GG. 
Okay, we're not getting uh, any like high low uh, 50-50s here, which is good. That's it's quite scary when fairy tends to do that. DP? No. DP? No. Okay, yes. They got there eventually. Bonk. Okay, this is nice. Oh, I missed my timing. Okay, 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 okay. We're we're out of it, folks. Oh, baby. Okay. Uh, are they gonna DG again? Oh, they ran up and hit me with the dog, man. Nice punish on the 5H there, though. Take a sip of water here real quick. Oh, actually, I didn't realize that whiffed at round start distance. There you go, we're picking up some tidbits of information. Right now, my brain is not going to process these, but dude, when I go to bed tonight, it's wild, man. Your brain is, is, is a strange little supercomputer. And uh, even, if, even if in the moment, you're like, what the hell is going on? Some, something somewhere is, is processing this. I, I believe. I know for a fact that some part of my brain is processing this. It's just, it's just, it's just not the one that's steering right now, you know? So uh, tomorrow, I'm, su I'm sure that I will, I will feel like a whole new man in terms of playing Grand Blue. I will have learned so much from this tournament, and it will be glorious. Ooh, nice. Get away from me, please. I'm like mashing Brave Counter on uh, on DJ there, and he just refuses to, to let me live. Is this a projectile? It's actually a good time for me to figure this out. Are some of her, is some of her whip stuff projectiles? Uh, that's a little preemptive. Yep. Oh, they didn't punish me for it. Interesting. I was trying to uh, maybe... You know the one where she spins the lasso and it's, yeah, that one? I thought that maybe that was a projectile and I could beat it with my super. But I wasn't certain. So that's why I wanted to try that. But I didn't actually wait the requisite amount of time there. Uh, is this going to hit us? How big is the vertical hitbox on this? Oh, non-existent. Good to know. Okay, okay. Fair enough. There is no... So that's good. You can jump over uh, Fairy Super Skybound Dart very easily. That is definitely good to know. Her DP has some pretty good vertical reach, right? But still. Oh, nice. We get punished there into a nice combo that leaves us still far away from her. Get away from me. Misses Dive Kick. Oh, yeah, yeah. That one is a lot harder to jump over, right? Can't quite get away with the same nonsense there. And there's the instant 50-50 uh, that I was... The high-low, right? That I was worried about earlier. Wondering why we weren't seeing it. Oh, I got hit by it again. Okay, well played. Uh, this is going to be the first game, almost certain. Right? Yes. Nice, nice. Well played. Let's try and uh, take it back here and go from there. Uh, what do you guys think? 6-6-H? Six, six Round start? Could happen to you. Okay, I just did 5-H because I was a little scared of how committal 6-6-H six, six was. But they both would have lost, so it's fine. Okay. GG. Oh, why did I why did I brave counter that? What a, what a silly time to be alive. Well, I mean, we're not going to be alive for very long if I keep being so silly. But Oh, the crossover. Oh my god. I didn't even think about that. I guess hitting the guard button on wake up there is not a horrible idea necessarily. Any deep ears? No. Any deep ears? They're just not scared. Fair enough. I've given them no reason to be. They, they're not spot dodging that yet. Maybe they... Oh, what the hell? Did that just lose? Why did that lose? Is her DP like not invincible frame one or something? What just happened? That was a, that was, that's like not fair. Oh, nice. They had spot dodged at that time. Okay, okay, they got it. They know. They just didn't react to that one time. Understandable. Fair enough. Uh, but yeah, what, what happened? Why did her DP lose there? Maybe maybe we, maybe it doesn't have like a ton of invincibility on it, and the the, the jump, the aerial hit hit her like after her invincibility was gone. Okay, well, I, I, even if I'm gonna not gonna hit her there, I just wanted to get past the wall of GG essentially. Ow! Oh my God, the crossover! I really need to be. I said I hit the guard button, and then uh, I didn't. But again, I'm I'm just saying all this out loud for my supercomputer to process uh, for a later day. Right now, the learning is probably oh God, the learning is probably not gonna happen. Ow! Eat my face. Are we dead? I think we are. Yeah. Well done. Well done. Okay. That's, uh, that is that game there. Kudos to them. GG's, in fact. We get to, they, they get to say that they, uh, they beat a Masters player. Though, again, I, I think we're, we're a little, uh, I mean, it's still, I'm not, not to diminish their achievement at all, I'm just saying. Maybe I'm not very much of an achievement right now. Um, let's hit him with the nice fight, though, and go from there. Uh, I, man, I feel, I'm, I'm starting to feel it. I'm starting to feel like, uh, I have hit a bit of a, a mental wall here. I know we have about 10 minutes left, uh, for the bracket, but I really might, uh, I might just... Call it here, I think. Uh, they won both the games. Well played to them. Yeah, so I think... Uh, what are we right uh, where, where can we see our standings, actually? I'm unsure. Dude, Senpai Spider, 10-1. and one. Crazy. Aaron Demack, Vermillion. Look at these guys. Very strong. Uh, where are we? We are 5-9. and nine. Hey, I am 5'9". That's how tall I am. So, clearly this was destined. Right? Yeah, 35% win rate. Unfortunate, unfortunate. Uh, but yeah, I think I think we uh, I think I'm gonna call it here, because again, I feel uh, I'm I'm feeling the I, like I, I was pushing through some mental fatigue earlier, but now it's just like I'm I'm completely out of here. Plus, hey, this is roughly the regular length for what the videos normally are, right? 
uh, about 30, 37, 40 minutes, right? Last one was an hour long, but yeah, I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I was a little different. I was a little bit, uh, I was a little bit tired here, but still, I had a good time at Paragon Line for sure. Again, I think uh, just because of my schedule, it's not going to be something I'll be able to do consistently. But moving forward, so you guys know that I think there's already been a couple of Tekken videos that have gone up on the channel. I'm recording a bunch of stuff in advance and posting it in different days and things like that. But I'm pretty sure we've had at least one Tekken 8 video go up on the channel now. So, uh... yes, yeah, yeah, for sure. So uh, to, to give you guys an idea of what's going to happen moving forward with tournaments, I think I'm going to pick... I, I tried three tournaments this week, right? I went to TNS, I went to City of Mayhem, I couldn't get, I couldn't make it to Waz, and I went to Paragon, right? I'm going to pick one or two of them and do them every week for a little bit, right? And we'll just have, you know, it'll be Tekken ranked matches and then some Grand Blue side content, like some guides and things like that I'm still working on. And then, you know, a tournament or two every week. I think, that, I think that'll be fun. I think that'll be a nice mix of content, right? We'll be learning a new game while still trying to keep our old game here from going rusty on us in, in Grand Blue uh, by going to tournaments. I think TNS and City of Mayhem looked pretty... They seem pretty good. I, I had a good time. So I think we'll make those the two that we go for. But uh, yeah, Paragon, as much as much fun as I had. One, I think it's it's uh, a little rough on the endurance for me, especially this, like, the time that it happens a little bit in... in What's the word that I'm looking for? A little bit inconvenient, I suppose, for the month that it is, if you know, you know. Uh, but then also, I think it's just a little a little much for me mentally and a little hard for me to fit in my schedule. So as much as much fun as I had, I don't think we'll be doing Paragon too many times uh, from now on. Uh, but regardless, still a good time. And uh, I'll, I'll send you guys out here. So if you made it this far in the video and had a good time, hopefully, uh, then I got four things for you, as always. Number one, uh, join the Discord server. You can talk to me about uh, this this run or anything else like that, right? Maybe we'll, we'll see each other in bracket and we can talk about it uh, at runtime there. But it's a nice place. There's a link in the description for you there. Uh, people talk about fighting games, Relink, Gacha games, Yu-Gi-Oh, TV shows, everything, right? So it's a nice community for you to hang out, make some friends, hopefully, and, and just talk about whatever you are you are passionate about. Um, it has been a very nice and welcoming community so far. I'd like to do any moderation at all, really. So I just one thing is if you do join, I implore you to keep it that way, please. I, I'm not going to hesitate to have to ban somebody's ass if I if I have to, but I haven't so far. So just don't be the first person to ever ban. You know, you don't want that reputation. Uh, for number two, if you liked the video, and I sure hope you did, get down there and like the damn video, man. Come on, it's free. It don't cost nothing. Really helps the channel, and I appreciate it a lot, of course. I know, again, these, these past couple videos, and especially this one, have been a little bit more muted, maybe, than, than some of the other ones. So I can't really tell uh, while it's happening. I'll be able to tell a lot better when I'm editing the video. But, you know, I'm, I'm a little I'm a little dizzy for now, but it's okay. You get to, you, you get to watch uh, me struggle through, because this is something that happens to everyone, right? You have bad days. This is something, so it's maybe, maybe this is still useful for you guys to watch. Um, but... Well, so I hope you liked it anyway. And uh, while you're down there liking the video, which you should be doing, uh, for number three, that subscribe button, that bell button, they're right over there, roughly. They'll keep you up to date with all this content here. We got something like two hours of content coming out every day. So, uh, you know, if you don't have two hours of free time to dedicate to just me every day, which I imagine is most of you, I implore you to hit those two buttons there to stay up to date with uh, things you don't quite catch when they come out. Uh, of course, uh, noon p.m. EST is going to be the fighting game time slot. Tekken, Grand Blue tournaments, Grand Blue guides and side fun content like the viewer tournament and the viewer battles and things like that. And 7 p.m. is Relink, which I highly encourage you to check out. It's a good time, I think. Uh, it's a different style of content, a lot more chill, a lot more just talk about numbers and mechanics and nerd out about uh, different builds and things like that. I think it's a, it's a lot of fun. Um, and of course, for number four, most importantly, more important than whatever buttons you hit or whatever algorithm-friendly interactions you hit me with, I appreciate those, but I hope you had a great time hanging out today, as always. I know I sure did, right? I'm definitely, you know, I'm, I'm fading a little bit here, but it's okay. I guess I'm going to go eat and, and take a nap or something right now, so it's all good, but I still had a really good time, right? I hope, uh... I, hope I, was, I don't think I was very whiny or anything like that, but I hope it doesn't come across that way. I still had a very good time in the tournament, so it's just, you know, I, we, we recognized the mental situation we were in, and we adapted our gameplay uh, accordingly, right? Hopefully my autopilot has been trained to command grab a little bit more and uh, we'll go from there. And we'll still, you know, that'll be a point of improvement there for sure. Uh, however, for now, as always, I'm having a lot of fun with Grand Blue and there's going to be a lot of Grand Blue and all sorts of content of all sorts of shapes and sizes coming your way. But until then, I will see you in the next one. Peace.